this problem is from random variables and distribution functions. And now we have to find out the mean and the variance of the uniform probability distribution given f of x is equal to 1 by n for x values ranges from 1, 2, 3 and so on n. See here the probability distribution is given as for the x values 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on n. So f of x value is 1 by n, 1 by n and so on. So now we have to find the value of mean as well as the variance. So for finding the mean what we have to do? So for finding the mean there is a formula that mu is equal to sigma i is equal to this is 1 to n this is xi into f at xi. Now we have to multiply each and everything here that is 1 into 1 by n. So this is the mean mu value that is 2 into 1 by n plus 3 into 1 by n plus and so on. This is n into 1 by n. See now what we have to take common. So I am taking 1 by n as common. If I take 1 by n as common what remains 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus and so on n. These are all the sum of n terms. The sum of n terms is nothing but n into n plus 1 by 2. Now I will cancel this n and the mean mu is equal to this is n plus 1 by 2. So this is how we have to find out the mean. This is so simple that the sum of n terms is nothing but n into n plus 1 by 2. And now later we have to find the variance. So for finding the variance again there is a formula. That is sigma i is equal to 1 to n. This is xi square f into xi minus mu square. See for finding the variance this is sigma square is equal to 1 square into 1 by n. See here this is 1 square into 1 by n plus 2 square into 1 by n plus 3 square into 1 by n plus and so on. So this value is n square into 1 by n minus mu square. What is mu here? Mu is nothing but n plus 1 by 2 whole square. So here the mu value will be as you know that mu value is n plus 1 by 2 here. So now I am going to substitute this one. The sigma square is going to become 1 into 1 by n. This is 4 into 1 by n plus this is 9 into 1 by n plus and so on. This is n square into 1 by n minus mu square. What is mu here? This is n plus 1 whole square by 2 square which is equal to 4. Now this will be the variance value. Now sigma square value is equal to. See if I take 1 by n common this will be 1 plus 4 plus 9 plus and so on n square minus. This is n plus 1 whole square by 4. So Sigma square value will be 1 by n times of this is 1 square plus 2 square plus 3 square plus and so on n square minus this is n plus 1 whole square by 4. So these are nothing but the sum of the squares of n terms. So as we have a formula that sigma square is equal to sum of the squares of n terms is nothing but n into this is n plus 1 into this is 2n plus 1 divided by 6 minus this value is nothing but n plus 1 whole square by 4 and see now n square sigma square is equal to 1 by n times of n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 by 6 minus this value is nothing but n plus 1 whole square by 4. And now if I cancel this n, what happens now? So n square will be, this will be n plus 1. This is 2n plus 1 and this can be written as 6 can be written as 2 into 3. See here and next n plus 1 whole square and 4 can be written as 2 into 2. So now which one I will take common? Sigma square is equal to this is n plus 1 by 2 if I take common. What remains here? This is 2n plus 1 by 3 minus this is n plus 1 by 2. And see here sigma square value is equal to this is n plus 1 by 
2 if i take 6 as lcm this will be 2 times of this is 2n plus 1 minus 3 times of this is n plus 1 so sigma square value will be n plus 1 by 12 this value is nothing but 4n plus 2 minus 3n minus 3 and now our sigma square value will be this is n plus 1 4n minus 3n is n minus 1 by 12 a plus b into a minus b is nothing but a square minus b square by 12 so this is how we have to find the variance see this is also very easy First of all, we have to multiply these two for getting the mean value. So, mean is equal to the sum of the n terms is n into n plus 1 by 2. And so, we got the mean mu is equal to n plus 1 by 2. And for getting the variance, we have to square 1 square into 1 by n, 2 square into 1 by n and so on. If I take 1 by n common, this will be 1 square, 2 square, 3 square and so on, n square. So, this will be n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 by 6. And mu square is nothing but n plus 1 whole square by 4. And after simplifying, we got the variance value sigma square is equal to n square minus 1 by 12. Thank you so much for watching and I will be uploading many more videos related to this series. Have a look at those. And if you really like, you know what to do. Take time to raise your thumb, pass it on to your friends and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much.